Hey guys, what's up? Spartan85 here. I wanted to bring you guys some news about 7 Days to Die Alpha 22 and the new console version that is coming hopefully soon. There's not a ton of news that is really coming out lately. I just wanted to put something out for October. The big thing is the Fun Pimps are going to have a playable demo of the console version, the new console version at TwitchCon. So if you're there, they're supposedly going to have a playable demo on PS5 that you can play. So if you guys are going to TwitchCon, I am not. But if you guys are going to TwitchCon, please let me know what you think if you got your hands on it. Love to hear what you guys think or maybe some other creators will get out there and, you know, talk about what they think. We only have the one video so far. The one, you know, the, the minute video of Alpha 22 on a console. So it'd be great to hear if it's playing better, if it's looking better, whatever. And I really hope that maybe they release this demo to the public, maybe YouTube creators or Twitch creators, or maybe people that's backed the game for a long time, or just put the demo on Xbox and Sony and, let, and build the hype for it. I mean, it's in their best interest to get this demo out, hopefully. So let's cross our fingers for a playable demo soon. They released some screenshots of some of the new POIs that they've been working on. Here's one of the strip malls, Java Coffee and Good Brew. Nothing really too fancy about it. I feel like a lot of the strip malls kind of look the same, but I will say I love the way the cities are looking in Alpha 21. They just seem to flow so much better than, you know, I, want the, I feel like the big cities really came out in Alpha 19 on the random gens and they just, they were, they didn't load very well. You got a lot of, a lot of frame drops and stuff like that, but uh, th these are, these are playing very well in the new version. And I really hope they play well on console when it does release. They released images of new palettes that are coming. Like I said, it's a slow news month. We're talking about pallets, <laughs> but we have cardboard pallets. We have the iron can pallets. So I'm guessing you can crush that down or, or scrap that down for iron and then probably get paper out of the paper pallets. But like I said, slow news month, uh, we're talking about pallets. And probably the biggest um, POI or biggest screenshots they released is the new Maven Hotel, which looks amazing. I can't wait to get in, check this thing out. And it has a, if in the back, it has a pool and little private areas in the back, little private seating areas, little bar. It looks like lots of things to search. And I'm guessing it's a tier four or tier five, probably a tier five, I'm guessing. So we've come a long way since the old console hotel, haven't we? I mean, look at this thing. <laughs> so I'm guessing the main loot, it's gonna have, like I said, it's gonna have a good, good main loot. And all these things, like I said, are coming to Alpha 22 and console. I love saying that, I love saying coming to console. It's so nice to, to finally say that. I really hope they release the demo. They look get our hands on this. There's been no news on a date yet. It's all just, you know, all speculation right now. I will say we're in alpha 21.2. We don't know how long they're going to go. My guess was 21.4 or 5. So if that's the case, we're about halfway through. Like I said, we don't know. The fun pimps have been historically tight-lipped about their release dates until they get very close. Now they are working with Sony and Microsoft though, which one would think that they're gonna need an actual firm date to release, So, but I don't know. I've said all along it's in their best interest to release before Christmas because pe then people are gonna be asking for gift cards and stuff to buy the game on the console, but they've also said it can be quarter one of 2024, so this could come after Christmas. It just really depends on their dev cycle. Having a playable demo now though is big that is big i don't think the fun pimps would bring this to twitchcon if it was not in a playable state it would make them look just horrible so having a playable demo that they are comfortable and confident about bringing and showing the public i think is huge and i think it's it's uh it speaks to their confidence in the uh, update and there's been no news about if there's gonna be a discount to current console players or anything like that we have no news on that the minute we hear news, though, I'll be sure and let you guys know. If you guys want to check out my channel, I do have 7 Days to Die console and the current Alpha 21 content on my YouTube channel. I play both versions. I love both versions. I think they're just two separate games. And I still love the console version. I still think it's one of the best survival games on console I, to this day. I still think it's one of the best. And I play other survival games, too. So I also stream Phasmophobia. And uh, I love playing Bigfoot and stuff, games like that. So if you're interested in any of that stuff, consider uh, subscribing or leaving a like. And uh, I'll catch you guys. I'll try to drop another update, hopefully in November. Or if we get any big news, I'll drop an update vid for you guys. So thank you for all the support, guys. I will catch you guys later. Bye.